Thank you, Maurice. All right, thank you. Thank you. Thank, hey, listen, it's, uh, it's, it's terrific to, to be here, uh, although I never worked in front of a round window before. It's, uh, I feel like I'm underwater. I expect to see fish. Anyway, Frank Gorse is my name. I'm not gonna do any impressions tonight because Maurice LaMarche is on the show, and uh, I will... <laughs> Now, people, people have, have, always, have, have always asked me, how, how do you do it? How, how do you do impressions? Do you, you stand in front of a mirror? Do you use a tape recorder? Do you go to a lot of movies? You know. Well, what I do is, I stand in front of a mirror, I, I use a tape recorder, and I go to a lot of movies. I, <laughs> I do all of those things. If that doesn't work, then I call Rich Little and say, hey, Rich, how do you do that? Or Maurice LaMarche, hey, Maurice, how do you do that? I don't know how I do them or why I do them, but when I was a kid, in high school, I used to work as an usher in a movie theater. And I got to see movies over and over again. And I just, just find myself doing these people. And I'd do them for the folks that came in for seats. If there was a, a gangster picture playing and a couple came in, I'd say, all right, the three of us are going down this aisle, but only one of us is coming back. Mm-hmm. You dirty rat. Mm -hmm. Or if it was a spooky picture, yes, just follow me and I'll put you in a nice box. Yes. <laughs> Good evening. Let me talk introduce myself. I'm Count Dracula. I'm going to kiss you on the medical's vein. <laughs> or if it was, uh, if it was uh, a Western, well, you just follow me. We gotta go through this field, but watch out for all that caca. <laughs> if it was a romantic comedy, yes, I've got seats for you down in front of the back upstairs, downstairs in the middle, anyway, you'd like this book right this way. Jew, did Jew, did Jew, did Jew. Kiss your death is playing with Richard Whitmark. I was working the balcony. And an elderly lady in a wheelchair came in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a big man. <laughs> I pushed her right down the stairs. Nine flights. She just kept rolling. Those are my violent beginnings. That's how I got to be everybody I am today. <laughs> Because of movies, all my life I've loved movies. To this day, I'm crazy about movies. I love movies. Especially gangster movies. With Western music. <laughs> I, <laughs> I call them wangsterns. I always love that part of the Western. <laughs> towards, <laughs> towards the end. The showdown. On one end of the street are Kirk Douglas and Burt Lancaster. Kirk says, <laughs> Hey, Burt. You know what today is? You know what time it is? Well, you know what we gotta do. Show those two killers. This town isn't big enough for the four of us. Is that right, Bert? That's right. I want to make you a promise. I swear to you, Kirk. I swear to you. I swear to you with every fiber of my being, with every bone of my body, with every breath I take, I swear I'll wrestle those two at six feet under. <laughs> now at the other end of the street are Marlon Brando and Jack Nicholson. Brando says. I've seen so many teeth. I've seen a lot of teeth in my day. Well, look at them. How do they do that? Like Crazy Jack. You ever see so many teeth?
Just can't believe you sometimes. That's right, my friend. I mean that sincerity from the bottom of my heart. I mean, some of the things that come out of your mouth just absolutely defeat my imagination. I can't believe what I'm listening to. All right, twinkle teeth. Double your pleasure, double your fun. Black count to three, we go for our guns. <laughs> Ready. It's one. It's right. It's two. It's right. Kim Asaba, what are you looking the other way for? You never pay any attention, no matter what's going. I'm getting ready to say three. Crazy Did you see that bird? It was my teeth. My teeth are so bright they had to look the other way. Oh, wait. What about my teeth? My teeth are brighter than your teeth. What did you say? I said, no, wait a minute, Kirk. What about my teeth? My teeth are brighter than your teeth. Yeah, but my teeth did the job. I'm a freight knocker. It was my teeth. My teeth. My teeth. My teeth. My teeth. My teeth. Oh. <gasps> my teeth. <clears throat> oh. a weird gun, Bert. I felt it, then I heard it. <laughs> I guess. I guess we're just gonna die right here in the street. That's right, Kirk. You take the right side, and I'll take the left side. Is that my right or your right? Mr. Frank Gorsham, ladies and gentlemen.